Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Faces Sergeant and welcome back to The Sims 2. This time we're taking a look at the artist career track, which can only be obtained by actually uh, graduating college. The degree that you get doesn't really matter, that is university. And basically the career award is this camera, which uh, doesn't really do anything. It doesn't boost your skill by a tremendous amount. It doesn't really do pretty much anything. But there, well, there is something it does. So your sim actually has to take a picture, then right down over here on the left side, that picture will pop up and you can just plop it down there. There are different effects that you can take to it, but this is basically it. This is what you get, and yeah, it's basically just, it's useless. You unlock it at level 5. Now let's actually get into uh, the skill requirements, the chance cards, and exactly how much money you'll be making. The first level is Canvas Scratcher. You are free on Mondays and Wednesdays. And the skills required to actually advance through this career are Creativity, Mechanical, Cooking, Charisma and Friends. And for the first level you'll be making 1,155 1, semillions per week. The next one is a Street Caricaturist. You'll be needing one creativity point in order to advance. And you are free on Mondays and Saturdays. You'll be making 1,785 simoleons per week. Next one is the Souvenir Whittler. You are free on Tuesdays and Thursdays. You will need three creativity and two mechanical in order to advance. And you'll be making 2,415 simoleons. Next up is the comic book penciler. You're free on Sundays and Fridays. You will need four mechanical, uh, four uh, creativity, three mechanical, one cooking, and two friends in order to advance. And you'll be making three thousand one hundred and fifty simoleons per week. Next up is wedding photographer. You're free on. Sundays and Tuesdays, you will need 5 Creativity, 4 Mechanical, 2 Cooking, 3 Charisma, and 4 Friends in order to advance, and you'll be making 4,040 Simoleons per week. Next up is Art Forger, you'll be making 5,356 Simoleons per week, you're free on Sundays, Fridays, and Saturdays. You will need 5 Creativity, 5 Mechanical, 3 Cooking, 4 Charisma, and 5 Friends in order to advance. Next up is Fashion Photographer. You will need 6 Creativity, 6 Mechanical, 3 Cooking, 6 Charisma, and 8 Friends in order to advance. And you're free Sundays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays, and you'll be making 7,140 simoleons per week. Next up is the acclaimed muralist. You are free Sundays, Fridays, and Sundays. Uh, so Sunday, Friday, Saturday, and Wednesday, you'll be making 6,696 simoleons per week. And you'll need 7 creativity, 7 mechanical, 7 charisma, 9 friends, and 4 cooking in order to advance. Next one is Conceptual Artist. You'll be making 7,875 simoleons per week. You are free Sundays, Saturdays, Fridays, and Thursdays. You'll, be you'll need 9 Creativity, 8 Mechanical, 5 Cooking, 7 Charisma, and 10 Friends in order to advance. The final level is Visionary. You'll be making 13,647 simoleons per week. You are free Sundays, Mondays, Fridays, and Wednesdays. You will need 10 Creativity, 8 Mechanical, 6 Cooking, and 7 Charisma, and 13 Friends overall. And that's basically it for the 
actual job itself now for the chance cards for level one you don't have any for level two you have two options go for it or tone it down if you go for it there's a 50 percent chance that you'll get 500 simillions and an 84 percent chance that you'll lose a day's pay if you tone it down there's an 84 percent chance that you'll get 3000 simillions and a 50 percent chance of nothing so go for tone it down level three you don't have anything level four you have two options talk about it draw on style and level four is the comic book penciler so if you go for talk about it there's an 85 percent chance that you'll gain plus one creativity and a 40 percent chance of getting fired if you go to draw on style there's a 14 percent chance that you'll get 5000 simillions and an 85 percent chance of losing a day's pay so I recommend skipping this one. For level 5, Wedding Photographer, there are no chance cards. For level 6, for the Art Forger, you have two. The first one is use oil paint. The next one is find chemicals. If you use oil paint, there's an 84% chance of getting fire, then a 50% chance of gaining 10,000 simoleons. If you go for the find chemicals, there's an 84% chance of getting 10,000 simoleons and a 50% chance of losing 1,000 simoleons. Go for the find chemicals. Now, level 7, fashion photographer, no, no trends cards. For level 8, acclaimed muralist, you have two options. The first one is take job, the other one is refer. If you go for the take job, there's an 84% chance that you'll lose 50,000 simoleons and a 50% chance that you'll actually get 50,000 simoleons. If you go for the refer, there's an 84% chance that you'll get 50,000 simoleons and plus 2 charisma points and a 50% chance that you'll actually get demoted to fashion photographer. So go to the refer option. Now for level 9, Conceptual Artist, there are no chance cards. For level 10, Visionary, you have two options. The first one is to pay the bill, the other one is Quick Search. If you pay a bill, there's an 85% chance that you'll get 100,000 simoleons. And a 40% chance that you'll lose 10,000 simoleons. If you go for a Quick Search, there's a 14% chance that you'll get 100,000 simoleons and an 85% chance that you'll lose 10,000 simoleons and 2 charisma points. So go for the pay bill option and that'll about do it for the artist career track. Overall the career reward is boring and not really useful unless you're into artistic crap. That's basically it.